Thank you for your interest in the City of Chino CDBG CV Microenterprise Business Grant Program. Chino has awarded nearly $100,000 in grants to the businesses in our city to assist them during the shutdowns from COVID-19. The funding mechanism is through the Federal CARES Act. On March 27, 2020, President Trump approved the Coronavirus Aid Relief and Economic Security Act. The CARES Act makes available $5 billion in CDBG coronavirus response funds to prevent, prepare for, and respond to coronavirus. The Department of Housing and Urban Development has allocated the City of Chino $330,471 to provide financial assistance to the community. The City has allocated $285,471 to the Economic Development Division for Business Stabilization Grants, up to $10,000 per business and up to three months of rental lease payment assistance for businesses undergoing financial hardship due to a loss or reduction in revenue directly related to COVID-19. So what is the grant for? Chino noted a hole that needed to be filled for struggling businesses, specifically the cost of rent. To assist city businesses, the grant is to be used for the cost of rent or lease payments. These payments will be sent directly to the landlord, so the recipients will not have to prevent reporting back to the city and HUD. These funds can be used to pay for rent from April 2020 to date. Rent includes the base rent, common area maintenance charges, and triple net charges, but will not cover late payment fees or penalties incurred because of a lack of payment. The difference between a grant and a loan. The program is grant funded by the federal government and is not a loan. This grant is not to be repaid unless the applicant is fraudulent or negligent in the application or does not honor the agreement. HUD may or may not review the application in the future to ensure the claims that were made to get the grant were true. In order to be eligible, all businesses assisted with a microenterprise business grant must meet all the following requirements. They must be a micro a microenterprise business, which means it's five or less people, including the owner. The business must be located and operating within the city of Chino. Businesses must be in good standing and have a current business license, have no outstanding code violations with federal, state, or local governments, have no liens against the business, meet HUD's criteria of a low moderate income benefit, have a verifiable loss of revenue income due to COVID-19 that justifies the need for assistance, and must have not received other business assistance from other sources, including federal, state, or county governments, the Small Business Administration, for the same type of rental assistance. And they must submit a completed signed application before the deadline of October 26, 2020 at 5 p.m. There are three ways in which to qualify. Your business location is within a census tract that serves an LMA area. You as the owner has a household that qualifies as LMI or more than half of your employees' households qualify as LMI. So what is low moderate income, LMI and LMA? Low moderate income or LMI refers to those whose income falls below 81% of the region's median income. The median income for San Bernardino County is $73,500 per household. Low moderate area or LMA is when <clears throat> a business benefits those who serve a particular area where 51% of those living in that area fall into the LMI category. For our grant, LMI is determined by income and circumstances caused by COVID-19 and has negatively affected the business and those being paid their salary by that business. The chart provided shows the threshold of LMI by the number of household members. Ineligible businesses. Businesses that do not qualify for the grant, whether through the City of Chino's guidelines or those put forth by HUD, are businesses outside of the City of Chino, nonprofit organizations, payday cash advance businesses, liquor or tobacco shops, pawn shops, firearm or other weapon dealers, adult entertainment, 
passive real estate investors, home-based businesses, and now also a duplication of benefits must not occur. If your business has received additional government assistance, you must make sure that there is no duplication of benefits. A duplication of benefits occur when you use two different sources of federal assistance to pay for the same bill. In our case, you must not use the City of Chino Microenterprise business grant funds to pay for rent if you've already used other sources such as PPP, EIDL, or SBA loan funds to pay for the same month's rent. These sources can pay for different months' rent, but not the same month's rent. The application form is very detailed and must include all of the following items on the first submission or it will be moved to the bottom of the stack and be the last to be considered during the application process. Potentially the program could run out of money before your application is reviewed, so ensure your application is complete. This is a general checklist of items requested, but there may be more detail depending on your household or type of business. We must receive the applicant and co-applicants contact information, a current city of Chino business license. We need to know the type of business, whether you're a sole proprietorship, partnership, LLC, et cetera. You must provide a business tax ID or social security number. You must provide a DUNS number, which is used to track all federal grant and loans. You must have a fully executed copy of your current rent and lease agreement. It can't be a blank copy or it can't be one that has not been signed. You must show a year to date profit and loss statement. That means from January of 2020 to date, not just what you get from your tax return. All household members bank statements for checking and savings. You must have a current business liability insurance policy. We, you must provide tax returns for all household members, including W-2s for 2018 and 2019. You must provide a list of the last six months income from any source, including payroll, unemployment, social security, et cetera, for all household members. You must provide a list of any and all federal aid, including EIDL, PPP, SBA loans, etc. Some of the fine print. All personal and business financial information will be kept confidential to the extent permitted by law. CDBG CV program participant files with personal and business confidential information will be kept in a safe and secure location. Any business applying for a financial assistance grant through the CDBG CV program has the right to appeal if their application is denied. The appeal must be made in writing to the city. A written response to the appeal will be provided to the applicant by the city within 30 days of receipt of the applicant's appeal letter. Exceptions are defined as any action which would depart from policy and procedure stated in the guidelines. The city reserves the right to make exceptions, but must comply with federal program requirements for business assistance. Once applicants are determined eligible, the program administrator will contact the business for execution of required documents and subsequent dis disbursement of the funds. No grant shall exceed $10,000 and CDBG CV funds will only be dispersed for eligible uses based on documented need. If you have more questions or you want to find out more information, contact Chris Kennedy, the Economic Development Manager, by email at ckennedy at cityofchino.org or at the phone number 909-334-3250. In addition, if you want to get on the website today, you can apply for the grant through the website by email or turn in your paperwork to City Hall. But the website address is www.cityofchino.org forward slash biz grant. That's B-I-Z-G-R-A-N-T. And best of luck.